Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is New York City Cichlids here. So the summertime is here. It's, the weather's been around 85 degrees in the Northeast. And using my tank glass lids, my tank's usually like 83, 84 degrees Fahrenheit, which we all know is a little too hot for most fish, especially for my African cichlids. All it does is bring up their aggression and they just start fighting each other. So it's always a good idea to keep the temperatures low. During the summertime, water evaporation is actually one of your best friends. It'll help lower the temperatures as the water evaporates and takes some energy with it. So today I have a really easy way for you to lower your temperatures, at least three or four degrees. Like I said, my tank usually gets up to 84 degrees when I have the tank lids on. So what I do is I open the glass lids to let some of that water evaporate so that the tank temperatures can go down. But what happens with African cichlids and a lot of other fish is they think they're free willy, so they like to jump. I've lost many fish during the summertime like this because as soon as they get startled, they just jump up and end up dry on your floor. So what I do when I open the glass lids is I actually use egg crate to cover the to cover the opening. I use egg crates and then I usually just put a big rock or you know a heavy enough rock or ornament on top of the egg crate so that it holds down the lids in case one of the fish jumps up and hits the egg crate or something. Another thing you want to remember is when the temperatures are higher in your water, the oxygen levels actually are lower. So you want to agitate your surface. To agitate my surface and my fish tanks, I usually just either lower the water level so that the canister filters in the outlet actually stir up the water, or I just point my circulation pumps to the surface of the water. Another thing, if you have a fan, like a desk fan or one of those clip-on fans, it would be a really good idea to point that at the surface of your water from the outside, of course. So that helps your water evaporate faster and cool more. So there you have it. I hope that these tips help you lower the temperature levels in your tank and raise the oxygen levels in your tank and help you get through the summer heat. Thanks.